Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, teacher. Everybody. Hello. Good evening. Everybody say good evening. <laughs> What's happened? Everybody, teacher. Hey, hello. Don't be shy. English is not for shy people. Remember that. Learning English is for communication. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Say good I'm evening in the tired. chat. <laughs> I'm a bit tired. I'm a little bit tired. Say good evening on the chat, please. What? Huh? Right on the chat. Good evening. Good evening, everybody. How are you? How was your weekend? What did you do? Where did you go? How was your day? Hello. <laughs> Good. Hello, hello. Are you okay? Good evening. From Benjamin, from Elisa. That's great. Mm -hmm. From Carla. Say good evening. From Cesar. Nice. From Karen. Yes. Teacher, in my case, today it was very stressful. Oh, really? It was yeah. Monday. Yeah. And the, the weekend, it was a little bit, a little <laughs> bit fun because I went to neighborhood birthday. Really? To yeah, a neighbor's it birthday. Was, it was fun. I, I like to eat cake. Nice. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I think we all enjoy eating desserts, cakes, candy, sweets. I like uh, as well. I like to pick pick up uh, or tell the candy. Yeah, candy. Yeah. <laughs> I, I nice. like to hit to hit the piñata. <laughs> yeah. Good. Mr. Aguirre is the only happy person in this class. What happened? <laughs> I don't know what's going on with them. <laughs> what's wrong? Well, I hope you are fine, people. I, I hope everything is okay. I hope you don't have issues. You don't have problems at home. I hope you can all get focused and practice tonight. A todos no. les dijo que se a, a todos les dijo que se a la cámara y como que el revés les dijo. <ríe> Hi. <ríe> ya empezaron a salir los brave, los valientes. <ríe> Mr. Benjamin, how's it going? Good. So, so. Hola. How is it going? How are you? Ah, uh, no lo he entendido. <laughs> Perdón. Really? Sorry. It's okay. Es que no, eh, sonaba muy, muy suave. El, el... How is it going? How is it going? How are you? And I'm way fine. To... You're fine. That's great. Yes. Your day, how was it? Mmm. A little tired. Uh, yes, a little tired. A little <clears throat> tired. Okay. Mr. Cassidy's. <laughs> no. How do you feel? <laughs> I'm very tired. Very tired. Yeah. Well. Yeah, it's the last thing you do and then you go to sleep, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, great, Mr. Cañas. Good evening, teacher. 
Good evening. Ready for the class? Mm, ready. <laughs> ready. <laughs> Working on the platform? Um, uh, a little. A little. little. Not much time to work. Uh, not much. <laughs> not much time. Mr. Henry, is this your first class? This is the first time in this class. We don't have audio, Mr. Henry. Something is wrong with your microphone. Uh huh. Maybe we can listen to you with the earphones. Yeah, usually we recommend to have earphones, headsets as well. Mm -hmm. No audio. <laughs> okay. Sure. Yes, sir. What about you on your weekend? It was good. It was good. I can't complain. It was really good. Actually, because of the COVID, I have to stay at home. I didn't want to visit my parents to protect them. I just called them on the phone. I stay home practically. Saturdays, cleaning, doing the laundry, cooking. <laughs> and yesterday, yeah, I went to the supermarket to do the basic things, you know. And today, working again. Yeah, it was a, it was a good day. It was a productive day. But thanks for asking, Mr. Very, Henry. Very very bored. I know. <laughs> kind <laughs> just of. I'm just kidding. <laughs> kind of. Yes. Actually, it's because the whole week I I spend it working, working, working. So on the weekend, I just realized that I have to do a lot of cleaning, lots of cleaning. It's true. Just the basic things. Mr. Henry, do you have audio now? You listen? Not really. That's terrible. <laughs> That's terrible. I'm sorry to hear that. All right. Let's get started. Uh, I'm not quite sure. Hold on. Give me just one second. Okay. I think I usually forget to do this. That's, that's okay. All right, here we go. Let me know when you can see the screen. Yes, is that okay? Sure. Sure, sure, sure. All right. This is our class number five and the name of the furniture. I'm sorry. Give me one second. Let's see. I need to edit this. Sorry about this. A letter U is missing. So go ahead. Furniture. Furniture. It refers to the mobiliario de la casa. Okay. Definitely, you have different furniture in the living room, different furniture in the bedroom, different furniture in the dining room, in the kitchen, right? So we're going to learn this vocabulary. We're going to learn to say, you know, different stuff, different appliances, for instance, that you have in the kitchen, the refrigerator, the stuff, the microwave oven, and stuff like that, okay? And of course, we're going to try to create sentences using there is and there are. There is is for singular, there are is for plural, right? And part of the vocabulary. Okay. Here's a lot crazy, right? The vocabulary is all mixed, but then we're going to classify. Armchairs, stuff, curtains, pictures, clock, bed, desk, television. Of course, this television is from a long time ago. <laughs> it's not a smart TV, okay? <laughs> All right. So don't complain about it. <laughs> then we got the sofa, rug, mirror, chairs, dressers, bookcases, coffee table, microwave oven, refrigerators, lamp. Uh, and table. Of course, you can have a lot more furniture, right? Definitely. There is for singular, there are for plural. 
For example, chairs. Where do you have the chairs? In the living room, the dining room, the kitchen? Uh -huh. In the dining room. In the dining room. There are two chairs in my dining room. There are four chairs in my dining room. There are six chairs in my dining room. So it depends of the number, right? But usually chairs, you have them in plural. In my case, there are four chairs in my dining room. Uh-huh. What about you? Anybody? How many chairs are there in your dining room? In, in my, my dining room. room. Huh? <laughs> Benjamin, go ahead. And then Mr. Aguirre, don't worry. Okay. <clears throat> uh, in my dining room, there are six chairs. Six, six chairs. chairs. So you get a big family <laughs> in a big dining room. All right, Mr. Aguirre? Um... <laughs> In my dining room, sorry, my dining room, there is no chair. Because there are no chairs. There are no chairs because really? are broken. <laughs> there used to be chairs, but there are no chairs anymore. <laughs> yeah, because my pets. You have dogs. Yep. How many uh, dogs? By the way, by the way, we don't like to eat. In, in the, the dining room. In the dining room, yeah. People usually eat on the sofas, in the living room, right? But not, in, but not in the bedroom. <laughs> depends. <laughs> it depends. Yeah, because okay. I feel, it, usually as I feel so tired, I ate in my In my bedroom. bedroom. Yeah. If, it is, if it is very cold too, right? People like to take the, the cup of chocolate to the bed <laughs> and the little piece of bread. True. As, as usual. <laughs> All right. But this is the case of plural. Remember, there are for plural. There are some curtains on my windows. Yes, there are some armchairs in my living room. There are some books on the shelf or in my bookcase. Bookcase or bookshelf is the same thing, right? So don't worry much about it. Okay, there are some pictures in my living room as well. So there are, for plural, there is for singular. For example, there is a stove in the kitchen, right? There is a refrigerator in the kitchen. There is a bed in my bedroom. There is a mirror in the bathroom, yes? There is a coffee table in my living room. There are some lamps in the, well, I have, I, yeah, I got some lamps in the bedroom as well, but there are some lamps here in the living room as well. There is a desk here in the living room as well. There isn't for negative. If you don't have, for example, in my case, there isn't a microwave open in my kitchen. I don't have a microwave. I have an oven, but not a microwave. <laughs> so there isn't there isn't a clock in my bedroom, but there is a clock here in the kitchen. There is a clock here in the dining room as well. So I have, yes. And there is a sofa here in the bedroom. I mean, in the living room as well. There is a rug. Yes, there is a rug under the television. There is a TV here in the living room too. There is a table in the dining room. There is a bookcase. No, well, there isn't a bookcase here in the living room. I have a bookcase in the bedroom. <laughs> uh-huh. So more examples, anybody? Let's see, for a table, I, yes? Hello? Can you connect the audio, please? <clears throat> it's a sofa in my bed. Uh -huh.
just one. Oh my God, I almost survived. <laughs> Sorry. I got the, the cough. Can you hear me? Yep, yep. All right, thank you. So who was participating? Can you know who was participating? Sorry. Miss Janet. Sorry. Could you repeat the sentence, please? Yes, there is a sofa in my bedroom. And nice. There is a mirror and a TV in my bedroom too. Mm -hmm. uh, there isn't um, a chair in my bedroom. All right, nice. Okay, somebody else? Mm. Melissa? Good night. Uh, Hello. Disculpen, entré un poquito tarde, así que no sé muy bien qué es lo que hay que hacer. Describir qué, qué muebles de los que están en el vocabulary tiene en alguno de los rooms de su casa. Bedroom, bathroom, kitchen, living room. In my bathroom... Uh, one bed in your bedroom yes there is a bed mm -hmm. there is a tv there is a tv uh -huh. um, pictures there are some pictures mirror there is a mirror. Chat. <clears throat> there is a chair. A table. There is a table. What else? That's all? Andrea? How about Andrea? Uh -huh. Andrea's not here. Okay. Good, good evening. Uh -huh. uh, I am Melissa. Um, <laughs> there is a TV in my bedroom. There is a bed. There is a, a chair. And there is a sofa. And there are some clothes on my bedroom. Okay. Somebody else? Brenda? Good night. Hello. Good evening, perdón. Good evening. Eh, <laughs> en bedroom, y the, there is a TV, there is a bed, there are dresser, sería el mueble para la ropa. Eh, there are cortinas. Cortinas. Okay. In my dining room, there, there are sofa. The, there are there is a TV. And there is a table. 
Okay. Perfect. Someone else? Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to... Hold on. I'm going to... Say some sentences. Si eso es cierto para ustedes, if it is true, ustedes tienen que poner una reaction. <clears throat> For example, this one, some. Si eso aplica para ustedes. Si es cierto. Por ejemplo, si yo digo, there is a TV in the living room. Y si eso es cierto en su caso, ustedes van a poner la reacción de thumb up. Yes? ¿Ya encontraron la reacción? Yes. Ok. <laughs> Perfect. Sí. Nice. ¿Empezamos? Can we start? Yes. Ok. <clears throat> There is a refrigerator in the dining room. Ok. Nice. Ok, la I siguiente. Guess so. I guess so. <ríe> In the dining room, ok, no dije en the kitchen. <ríe> Ahora tienen que poner la de clubs. There are, there are curtains on the windows. Ok, great. Now the reaction has to be the surprise. Okay, yes. The evidence. Okay. Adjunto pruebas. <laughs> there are there are bookcases in the living room. There are bookcases in the living room. Wow, just Melissa and Karen and <laughs> Mr. Pidal. Okay, Mr. Mario Caña, there are books, right? so you have books, nice. Okay, the next reaction has to be this one, party. Oh, Mr. Aguirre as well, celebration. There are pictures on the walls in my bedroom. There are, no. <laughs> there are pictures, yeah, there are pictures on my wall in the bedroom. No. <laughs> okay. The next reaction has to be the heart. Okay. <laughs> There is a fan in my bedroom. A fan. A ventilador. <laughs> There's a fan. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ok, si sí, tienen todas las reactions, right? Tienen todas estas, todas estas caritas. All right. So, the next one would be, let me see, oh my God. <clears throat> the next reaction, busquemos la de happy, no, the relaxed face, this one. <laughs> there are there are plants in my garden. Okay, nice. Some people have plants in their gardens. Okay. All right. Next one, Mr. Benjamin has a question. No. <laughs> Or just a reaction, like raising hand. <laughs> okay. Let's use the thumb up again. Thumb up. Like this, the like. Okay. There are dishes in the kitchen. <laughs> I can't fight. <laughs> the like. Okay. That one? Yes. All right. Next. There is... There is a sofa in my bedroom. 
<laughs> Next reaction. All right, like. Okay, good. Well, as I was yeah. sharing, yes. Barely, I have chairs. <laughs> I barely have chairs. Yeah, take a picture just... or take a screenshot and describe. For example, if I'm working with a partner, I would say, please describe the furniture in your living room. Oh, please describe the furniture in your kitchen. Or please describe the furniture in your bedroom. Please describe the furniture in your living room. Yes? So I'm going to give you the screenshot. Don't worry, okay? So I'm going to make groups of, <clears throat> let's see, of three people, three to four people. And, well, I have been pairs. Oh, no, I'm going to recreate fewer groups. Yes, three to four people in each group. And then, please describe the furniture in your kitchen. Please describe the furniture in your bedroom, your bathroom, your living room, and so on. Okay? <coughs> Let me get the screenshot and put it in your... Okay, you were not assigned or you couldn't move to the rooms. Hello. Hello. Practice. Okay. Um, I'm practicing me in my bedroom. The, um, <clears throat> um, there are four sofa sofas in my living room. Um, there are a TV. Uh, there is a TV. There is. There is a TV. And there are some books in my living room. Um, that's all. Okay. Hmm, I sleep. <laughs> also, uh, there is a refrigerator. That's all. Okay, in my living room, there are, oh no, there is a refrigerator as well. I haven't a chair, but my pet beat all chairs for the reason there is no, there is no chairs. Uh, as well, there is microwave oven. And let's see, let's see, there is stove. That's it. Uh, in, in my kitchen, there is a stove, there is a microwave oven, and uh, there is a 
Refrigerator. Ref <laughs> Sorry. Uh, there is a TV in my living room and there are two sofa in the living room. There is a mirror in the bathroom and there is a bed in my bedroom. There is a microwave oven in my kitchen. And there, there are uh, there are curtains in my window around my house. And there is a stove in the kitchen too. Okay. Okay. Hey, welcome back. Hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, how did it go? Do you have any question? Any question, any doubt? Did you describe your rooms and the furniture you have in each of the rooms? Good. Yes. Puede volver a repetir cómo se pronuncia, por ejemplo, refrigerador. A mí me cuesta un poco. Refrigerator, like Terminator. Refrigerator. <laughs> like Terminator, exactly. Ajá, a veces estos tips parecen divertido, pero sí es cierto. Se puede como relacionar, como para recordar más fácilmente. Yes. Refrigerator, Terminator. Alligator. <ríe> yes, refrigerator. No problem. No, está súper. Igual ustedes pueden preguntar si es cuestión de práctica también. Don't worry. ¿Ok? ¿Alguna otra que les haya sido difficult? Armchairs, stub, curtains. Los curtains es un poquito. El microondas, Mike. Microwave, no microwave, microwave, oven, oven, mm -hmm. oven, oven, microwave, oven, like oven, v, v, v. microwave, oven, oven. Mm -hmm. dresser, curtains, pictures, clock, lamps, desk, bed, television. Television or TV, people use it both. Rug, mirror, chairs, bookcase, table, armchairs. Igual, pueden haber muchas más cosas, right? This is like representative, okay? There are so many other things in the house. We do have lots of things in the kitchen, for instance. You have the blender, the juice maker the toaster right lots of appliances oh we haven't talked about the washing machine the laundry room right we haven't talked about the the fun the dvd player the stereo there are so many more things actually right many more things okay all right we have a conversation about an apartment. So if you see somebody is moving, okay? And this person has brought all the things in the boxes for the living room, right? So this apartment is great, says Christopher or Chris. Thanks, I love it, but I really need some furniture. What do you need? Oh, I need lots of things. 
There are some chairs in the kitchen, but there isn't a table. And there's no sofa here in the living room. And there aren't any chairs. There's only this lamp. So let's go shopping next weekend. So Chris probably is helping. Um, yeah, he's probably helping her, Linda, to move into a new apartment, right? Of course, in some places, not in El Salvador, well, maybe. Some places in El Salvador, when you move to a new place, to a new apartment, to a new house, maybe there are some furniture, but maybe not, right? It all depends. And you have to get all the things move from one house to another house, from one apartment to another apartment. So who has the experience to move? ¿Quién tiene la experiencia de haberse mudado? Nobody? Nobody has ever moved. When I was a child. Oh, okay. Benjamin has moved from one place to another. When you were a child, you used to move from one house to another. Uh -huh. So here, the tradition is that you have to move all the furniture, right? But in in the United States, it's different, right? So in the apartments, there are usually lots of furniture. So you don't have to move chairs, tables, dressers, closets, refrigerators or stuff and all that. So you find it in the new apartment. Or sometimes the new apartment is smaller and you have furniture, so you cannot bring all the furniture, right? So we're gonna practice the conversation, okay? If you have any question, please let me know, okay? This apartment is great, thanks, I love it. But I really need some furniture. What do you need? Oh, I need lots of things. There are some chairs here in the kitchen, but there isn't a table. And there's no sofa here in the living room. And there aren't any chairs, there's only this lamp. So let's go shopping next weekend. Any question, any word that you can not pronounce or you want to know, tell me, or it's an easy conversation. Do you need to practice? Let's see, let's practice Mr. Mario and Mr. Manuel Romero. Are you ready? I'm Chris. Okay, go ahead. Yes. One, two, three, go. Okay, this apartment is great. Hey, I love it, but I really need some furniture. What do you need? Oh, I need lots of things. There are some chairs in the kitchen, but there isn't a table. And there's no sofa. Here in living room. Um, there aren't any chairs. There's only this lamp. So let's go shopping next weekend. Good. All right. Somebody else? Miss Janet? Wanna practice? Okay. Okay, Melissa, are you ready? <clears throat> Me? All right, go ahead. Okay. So, start moving. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this apartment is great. Thanks, I love it, but I really need some for tonight. What do you need? Oh, I need a lot of things. There are some chairs in the kitchen, but that there isn't in a table. <clears throat> And there's no sofa here in the living room. And there aren't any chairs. There's only this lamp. So let's go shopping next week. Next weekend. Yeah, so. next weekend. So let's go shopping next weekend. Yes, the words furniture. Remember furniture. furniture. Yes. And what is the meaning about furniture? 
tables, chairs, lamps, refrigerators, es mobiliario. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Uh -huh. We need lots of things, lots of things. We need many things, right? We need lots of things. Okay, some other volunteers. Somebody okay. else, yes? I didn't know that when I mean about the one sofa, uh, the word is uh, arm, arm chair. Arm chair, yes, it's because it's for your arms, to rest your arms. That's why it's a single sofa, it's called an arm chair. I thought that sofa is all sofa. For all type of sofa. <laughs> yeah. A sofa is usually long for big, I mean, for more people, right? A big sofa. Mm -hmm. For that reason, I didn't know. That's great, no problem. Okay, somebody else who wants to practice? No more. Okay. Remember the singular, there is. In plural? There are. There are. There are. In negative, there isn't or there aren't, right? So, in the chat, traten de sacar las oraciones afirmativas usando there is y las afirmativas usando there are. Y luego busca las, las negativas, there isn't, y las negativas con there aren't. Tienen que encontrar al menos una de cada una. Y las escriben en el chat, please, de la conversation. No las vayan a dar enter, solo escriban. And then, when I say enter, todos le van a dar enter. Porque si usted le da enter, enter la van a copiar. Yes, so you have to get from the conversation, affirmative, there is, affirmative, there are. Negative, there isn't. Negative, there aren't. Completa la oración. Yes? Me avisan cuando ya los tengan, ¿ok? Let me know when you're ready. Teacher, me no understanding. Can you read? <laughs> Too difficult. Really? For real? Teacher. You're what not kidding me. Are you kidding me? I don't understand. Can you explain me again? Really? Because I can hear you so clear. On this conversation? Yeah. You have to identify one affirmative sentence using there is. <laughs> one affirmative sentence using there are. Oh, one, okay, that's it. Uh -huh. <laughs> I got it, I got it. Negative, there isn't. Negative, there aren't. Eh, hello. Eh, perdón, voy a hablar en español. Es de lo que está dentro de esta... De la conversation, yes. Ah, ok, gracias. Uh -huh. Ok, thanks. Well, uh, can... <laughs> can I speak Spanish? No, no kidding. <laughs> Do it. What happened? Do you really need to speak Spanish? Ready? No, yet. 
not yet. Okay. Are you ready? You've got it? <clears throat> yes. Okay. No, se me borraron todas las. <laughs> For real. Oh. No yes. way. Yeah. That's what? too bad. A mí también me pasó. Sí, Cuando cerré el chat y lo volví a abrir, ya no había nada. Okay. Sorry. Tiene que volver a digitar. Type it again. No problem. No problem. Ready? Mm. In progress. In progress. Ready. Ready. Everybody? Okay. Go ahead. Let's see. Okay, great. Melissa, there are some chairs in the kitchen. There is no table, there is no sofa. There aren't any chairs. There's a lamp. Okay. Mr. Romero, there's a sofa in the living room. There isn't a sofa in my bedroom. There are four beds in my house. There aren't pictures in my dining room. Okay, this is about your house, right? There are some chairs. There isn't a table. There's no sofa. There aren't any chairs. There are some chairs in the kitchen. There is only this lamp. There aren't any chairs and there isn't a table. That's right. There are some chairs, there isn't a table. There aren't any chairs, there is no sofa. There are some chairs, there's a lamp. There aren't any armchairs, there isn't a table. There are two armchairs in, the, in my living room. There is a sofa, there are no chairs in my in my what <laughs> there's no refrigerator in my dining room dining okay there aren't some chairs mm, there are some chairs because some is only for affirmative there's a sofa there are any chairs there isn't okay here we need to correct there are some chairs or there aren't any chairs negative right there is a sofa oh there are some sofas there are two sofas there are some chairs or there aren't any chair right oh, huh. oh bedroom okay 
there isn't a table, there aren't any chairs, there aren't, so there are some chairs, there are some chairs, there's a table, there are, there aren't any chairs probably, it's Brenda Escobar, okay? In affirmative, there is, there are. In negative, there isn't, there aren't, remember, okay? So, let me just stop sharing this. Hold on one second, please. I just need to move on. Okay. Me pasó lo mismo, teacher. Se le borró. Everything was erased. <laughs> there, therefore, the test is canceled. Ah, <laughs> no, please. <laughs> okay. All right. I know you For just... this, I don't say more sentence because all the races will they get like erased back to the chat. Oh, that's so sad. Well, you already wrote. Yes, the sentence. There is a table. There are three sofas. There is a typo here. I might correct it, correct it later. There is a refrigerator. There are four chairs in the dining room. Describe what you've learned in class today. Uh huh. We're gonna choose three people from the class today. See, Mr. Romero, one, Melissa, two, and Mr. Henry Lopez, three. Tell us what was the class about today? Mm -hmm. uh, el, the use, uh, uh, there is and there are. Mm -hmm. what and else? vocabulary and the vocabulary good thank you uh-huh next 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 who's next i said three names only one has participated Mm -hmm. Who was the other person? Um, yes. We learned about there is and there are and how can use it. How to um, use it in affirmative and eh? Negative. And negative, exactly. Uh, the vocabulary. A lot of vocabulary related to? That's all. To furniture in the house, right? In the different rooms. Okay, who was the other person? Uh-huh. Nobody. <laughs> it was a ghost. <laughs> Teacher, I yes. have a question. Tell me. Do you know what's the meaning the mystify? What is it? A movie? A show? Oh, I heard a conversation but but American people and some say to uh, other people. The mystify. I don't know. I don't know. It must be an internal joke. <laughs> Probably it's not so global yet. Uh huh. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. Well, it's about time. I appreciate your attendance. I think somebody else wrote. Yes. Yes, Mr. Lopez wrote this. The explanation. He has problems with the audio, he says, okay? So thank you for explaining, okay? It's about time. I hope you have a good night. Enjoy, rest, sleep well, pray God. <laughs> so I can see you tomorrow. The most, the most important, pray God. Yes, thank God.
It is important. Thank I you. Good night. Good night. Blessings. Good night, Mr. Hello. Lopez. Hi, everyone. Good tomorrow. Have a good one. Good tomorrow. All right. Bye-bye.